Students, today we are going to start uh, our course. Uh, the title of the course is Methods in Biotechnology. किसी भी लैब में किसी भी बायोटेक्नोलॉजी की फैसिलिटी में सबसे ज़्यादा इम्पॉर्टेंट चीज़ होती है वो नोटबुक होती है तो आज का हमारा लेक्चर जो है वो नोटबुक और उसके पर्पस के हवाले से है द पर्पस ऑफ अ नोटबुक इज टू रिकॉर्ड द मैथड्स एंड द रिजल्ट विच यू ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम योर एक्सपेरिमेंट्स दीज रिजल्ट आर लेटर इंटरप्रेटेड बाई यू फॉर योर फ्यूचर वर्क or these methods can later be used by other researchers for uh, their own experiments the notebook is very important document for patent review if you want to go for future uh, patent registration your notebook will provide the original data for this purpose therefore a notebook must be maintained and thoroughly maintained The question comes that who is the owner of the notebook? In any lab, in any industrial laboratory, the ownership of the notebook is always of laboratory or the institution. The notebook should not leave the laboratory or institution. What type of or what uh, format of a notebook one should use? normally we deal with two types of notebooks one is in the loose sheet form which is ring binding and the second one is in the permanent bound form the permanent bound form is a gold standard notebook to maintain the records because it has some advantages over the loose sheet notebook the advantages of the bound notebook are that you have no fear of losing the sheets it provides a proof against frauds whereas the disadvantage of the bound notebook is you cannot group together similar kind of experiments jab dusri taraf dekha jata hai loose leaves ko jab use kiya jata hai there is always a chance to lose the sheets to lose your key results and advantage is over there you can group different types of experiment you can group the results but if there is a fear to lose the results in this kind of notebook it is not normally preferred over the industrial or research facilities if you look at this end this is a ring binding this one is a permanent bound form of the notebook that needs to be preferred in the laboratory the size of the notebook is universal a4 size it should have dimension of 8.5 inches into 11 inches the pages should be numbered and graded the pages can attach the photographs and print out in the notebook while making your observations your results or your methods recorded in the notebook use ink preferably the ball points the use of lead pencils are not this authentic source to make the data recording in case if there is any error there should not be blanking out or whitening out of the error simply cross by a single line write legibly so that besides you others can also read your recordings